be calling you a radical. So this is, they've reached a new low. You know, the energy crime, that's my path over the last eight years from the classroom to being bone marrow biopsied. I've had 13 of them now to the bone marrow freaking transplant center to trying to save you from you freaking doing all the investigative journalism doing what Jacko and gang should have did. They were paid to do the EPA, the DNR, all these agencies that betrayed us. So they've reached a new low. The, the inter Nuclear Energy Crime Syndicate has reached a new low. So their propaganda now is they're taking high school students and junior high students and they're taking different dishes made from Fukushima produce, Fukushima stuff, and testing it on high school students and junior high school students to see Pearl Harbor on Balco on chemo, the peasants, to see if they like it on high school students. Now, to PG&E, PG&E, this is important because this is the Water School of Art, by the way, which blackballed me, you know, but there's a new sheriff in town. These young students here love me. I mean, I have a huge, big following here now, and they're all very young, and uh, the art's starting to come out, I'm telling you. The art is starting to come out. They're awake. Oh, are these freaking young ones awake? So, PG&E, let's talk about these scumbags. They're going to prison. They're going down. So now, because there's some, some investigative journalists, now PG&E should have went to prison on the San Onofre cover-up. Now, that'll be seven years. These are the people that built. That's who built the reactors at Fukushima, Japan. That's who built it. You talk to this is who built the reactors at Fukushima and at San Onofre. They're the exact same identical reactors. That's who built them. They both have melted down. The cover up, Kamala Harris raided their house, got the goods. She was an attorney general then. They should have went to prison then. Oh, they're going to prison now. So PG&E is going to be GE. They're filing bankruptcy. That's what they'll do. They're going to try to the old GM scam. They're going to file bankruptcy, fuck all the shareholders, fuck all the bondholders, fuck all the municipalities, fuck everybody, kill the sea, burn the fires, Fuctonium fires, Fuctonium fires, a country of fucking liars, Fuctonium deniers. By the way, the meltdowns at San Onofre, Fukushima, so correlated, which the fires are nuclear. They're Fuctonium. I mean, when there's three suns inside the melting down. They're letting off a plasma into the Pacific Ocean. Hello, it's not that complicated. It's not. Took Lake Barrett on 60 minutes, 2850 days to tell you what Kevin Blanche told you. It's not that complicated. Bringing star power to Earth, Livermore, back to Kamala Harris. Her mother was the epidemiologist at Livermore, died of cancer, the activist. So they're going to prison. Well, I'm telling you. So now it's coming out. They were in Maui. They flew to Maui while the Fuctonium fires raged and murdered people. Fucking their dereliction. Well, catches up. You know, it's just like, I remember uh, Mike Tyson. I'll never forget this. Mike Tyson says, I never raped that girl, but I sure deserve to be in prison. Not for the rape of that girl. Shh. I didn't do that. It was consent, but the shit I did before, I deserve to be in prison. That's what this is. So... The DNR in Utah were recording the worst air in world history right now. So here's the rumor. The Department of Natural Resources, the corrupt county missioner that freaking stole all the money, got away, he works for him now. Rumor is, I got yesterday, because I live by him, they flew to Maui. That's what I hear, got out. Ha! Well, they can't do nothing about it. Yeah, just fly out on your money. That's what they can do about it. Fucking corruption, derelict fuckers, PG&E going to see, just like, so General Electric reports, now get this, the same day on the seventh anniversary of the San Onofre meltdown. Now, I'll be in PB on Friday. I'm gonna, I'm headed there Friday. So Rachel and I will do a bunch of work together too. She's got the data from Japan on the school children. She has it. She gathered it up at the schools for a year and a half in Okinawa and freaking she had it independently tested. That stuff, I have it all. I have it all. We have it. We are the investigative journalists as they try to make a sequel out of me, you know, shut us up. So I have to put up all these videos and I want people, vloggers and bloggers, it doesn't matter how many views you get, you have to tag it and get it in there into the library. So it's 
there for his story because the vloggers that all took on Fukushima, remember Magic, uh, Jan Miss Milky the Clown, what's her name? She got sick up in, uh, uh, what was her name in Ottawa? But they'll tell you right to your face, the only reason we took it on is we hated Obama and we love Trump. That's why they quit. I'm not kidding you, they'll tell you that. We just hated Obama, we didn't care. We're just doing it because we hated Obama, which I hate him too, but I hate Trump even just as bad because they're the same nuclear freaking rats. So you want to, that's why they all quit. They ran to Bitcoin and got freaking their heads sawed off again like they did on fucking silver, like they did when they told you to sell your Dow at fucking 9,000. Well, PG&E just got their head ripped off Economic, but they don't care. They got all the fucking money. They'll get their golden parachutes unless they put them in. Look, it's this simple. Same in Utah. White collar crime is not illegal here. It's not encouraged. It's taught here. It's taught. It is the Mormon way. It is the PG and way. It is the United States corporate way. As Dirty Herbie told me right to my face, as his father died of leukemia, Mike Lee, they tell him, he likes to quote what's his name's quote. Culture eats policy for breakfast. And I said, yeah. But you know what fucking has culture for lunch? Cancer. The cancer. So the new economy, the economy of betrayal, that's what the new economy, the U.S. economy, the economy of betrayal, of white collar crime, until you put these fuckers in prison, I've been saying this for decades, until you lock the fuckers up, nothing's going to change because they can always find a way to backdoor the money, just like GE did, fucking, they'll file bankruptcy, they'll fucking, Jeffrey Melt was inside the situation room, so this PG&E thing, just like a Flint, Michigan, the low-lying fruit went to prison. Have they gone to prison yet? Hmm, I don't know. Just like in Wisconsin, the making of a mass murderer is one car drives right by the police with her in the trunk. Just like fucking the making of a mass murderer. They try to fucking get a bill across now for nuclear energy in Wisconsin. Fucking cheeseheads have lost their fucking mind. Where is all these agencies? Where are all these people that are supposed to protect the CPA? Gregory Jacko now doing it. So there's been two pieces done now. Gregory Jacko came out yesterday. Channel 7, Mark did a interview with him which is a great piece i've reached out to mark thank you thank you for doing that and he got him to talk just like i'm the one that talked her into doing the vlog with holder and it's starting to leak it out I'm, I'm cracking it these people are now not only were they derelict in duty that killed you and they were paid to protect you now they're writing books and profiteering it's called as i call it the profiteering of betrayal that's what the country is. Up is down, black is white. These are important fucking videos and important stories because no one's doing it besides Dana and I. Because everybody ran away and so let's get physical, physical. <laughs> I remember meeting Olivia Newton-John right here in this building. Yeah, she sang here. Let's get physical. But that's the problem with the act, act, activist community. They got unphysical. So... The vloggers and the vloggers are ideologues. All we hear is Radio Goo Goo, Radio Gaga. I mean, nine million fucking vloggers and bloggers. What are they talking about? Because they think they're going to answer. They think they're going to make some money. Be a new fucking wine. You feel the love tonight. The fucking wannabe, wannabe, wannabe. Trump and Obama are identical nuclear fucking twins. So the DNR, as we record the worst air quality in the history of the fucking state. Right here, right now. Huh. They're in Maui. Hope you fucking dirtbags don't get cancer. They killed their own mother. They don't care. Multiple myeloma fucking roundup fucking rodeo. So, the pg and &E, I'm telling you, I'm going to tell this right now to Gavin. Put him in fucking prison. I mean, all of them. Right from the top. They tell you put him in prison. They should have been in prison in San Onofre. The crime. San Onofre had a meltdown seven years ago on the 30th. That'll be the time GE reports, and when GE reports, you're going to see the biggest fraudulent earnings report in U.S. stock market history. Because all they're saying, we got to get the stock go up, we got to get the stock to go up, we got to get the stock to go up. That's all they care. That's all they care. In fact, read it, read it. The incentive, the golden parachute, they gave this culp. They can't cope. Fucking, you know, after the 15th fucking one, they're trying. Just make the stock go up. It's his whole package is tied to the making the stock go up. So you're going to see, and they got away with it because the SEC. The DOJ caught him. We've lied for 30 years. We're under investigation, the DOJ, but they won't do anything. That's a fact. Look it up. G's under investigation by the DOJ. The DOJ didn't tell us that. Huh, they slipped out in one of their earnings, their lying earnings report. Ha, 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 ha. We cheated on our earnings report for 30 years. You're not going to do anything to us. Ha, ha, ha. So watch this lie come on the 30th. You'll see a lying earnings report 
probably because, and then the wheels of injustice, the court system. So they file lawsuits and they just, just like, you don't believe me? What about the USS Reagan case? Let's fact track to go forward. <sighs> just on August 25th, that's all, of 2014. Oh, it's impossible one guy could be right on this one. They, I'm the only one that was there. The only journalist that was there. <laughs> I mean, you got some radio vlogger, blogger, whatever she calls her, up, nuclear fucksy. <laughs> that ain't an activist. That's a regurgitating, fainting go to fucking club, fucking talking to each other, radio gaga. By the way, I'm doing a radio show right here. Just a few minutes. But I'm activist. I do the work. So they're human lab ratting, guinea pigging their own kids now. Somebody said to me one time, well, oh, oh, you're teaching our kids, kid, kids. I'm a university professor. These are grown fucking adults. You know, kids don't go to fucking universities. I guess they have to be taught what should have been taught junior high and high school. You don't believe me? You don't believe me? They're teaching stuff that should have been taught. Let's get physical, physical, let me do it. I do the fucking work. I'll be tied, pull, jumping, Bob Beeman, Blanche. I'm tied. So I'll be there Friday. So I'm going to hook up with Rachel and we'll get all this data. She's got more. We have videos of Gregory Jacko and the Emperor, or the Emperor, and now that'd be Yoko Ono, anti New York, the Prime Minister, the ex Prime Minister, who comes out every chance. He's great, by the way. He's the real great actor. He calls it be the greatest terrorist to ever walk the face of the earth. That's how my work sets it is. You know, Trump, Obama. So now they're testing Fukushima food on the kitties. <laughs> oh my lord, pg e going to prison. I'll tell you what, unless you rise up, California's no one's gonna do it. Unless you put them in prison. They'll just bankrupt and raise your stock. They got plenty of money. Same with Utah. Utah, the Dion, I mean, they poison you, kill themselves, degenerate America. <laughs> Tell you put them in prison, nothing's gonna happen. Flint, Michigan on chemo, on Balco. The Fukushima cover up, the sending off a cover up, makes Flint, Michigan look like fucking church mice. And it was our own government agencies that did it.